Hey everybody, this is Lyrical, and I am here with... The Nerdy Cooking Lady. That's her, right. Yeah. Alright, today we're going to be making some pralines, mm -hmm. and what you need to do is have one and a half cups of pralines. Those are pecans. Pecans, yeah, <laughs> pecans. <laughs> <laughs> Three-fourths cup of brown sugar, one and a half cup of milk, <laughs> three-eighths cup of butter. <gasps> True and flat gave us that? That's right. Damn. <laughs> um, one and a half cups of white sugar. Yeah, that's three-quarters cup brown sugar. Yeah, I hope I said that. Anyway, and a teaspoon of vanilla extract. So, let's go ahead and begin. Yeesh. First, we're gonna put what a layer of foil in our pan. Yeah. Foiled again. That's right. Now put it aside. Put it aside. All right. Next thing we want to do is pour in some of our ingredients into a large saucepan that will be on your stove on medium heat. All right, so right now we are going to combine our pecans. Our sugar. Brown sugar. <laughs> it's clean, I promise. Let's see if we can't get that little bit. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We can't put any on the burner, dork. Next is our milk. You sure you're supposed to be putting this all together? That's what the stuff says. That's awesome then. And last but not least, our vanilla. Our vanilla. Feel free to spray that all over the stove too. Bite me. Mm-hmm. You're going to want to heat that between 234 and 240 degrees Fahrenheit or until a small drop of the syrup stuff that the nuts are floating and baking in can be dropped into some cold water and forms a little ball. That'll mean that your pralines are done cooking and need to be spread out onto the cookie sheet for further cookage. Yeah. We need to take little spoonfuls of the praline mixture oh, man. and drop it onto the baking sheet that has the foil on it. Making sure you get a good amount of nuts and caramelly goodness. Just like the expert Lyrical is doing. I wouldn't say I'm an expert. This is my first attempt. At this point, that makes you an expert over me. <laughs> Scold that praline. Tell it That's to stay right. within its boundaries. That's right. Tell them no means no. Boundaries are a thing. <laughs> You're doing pretty good. All right, guys, we are going to put all these on, and we'll see you guys back there in a little bit. Yep. All right, since I'm apparently the expert at mentioning the Gamers and Geeks Can Cook playlist, I would like to mention the Gamers and Geeks Can Cook playlist. Playlist composed of all gamers and geeks that can cook delicious, nummy food like Lyrical and myself. Want to be on the playlist, too? Well, you make a cooking video, any sort, holiday, fun, your family food, whatever you want, and you tell... 
People I can't remember. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> you tell Vault Girl and Javik of Death about it, and they'll put you on the playlist. It's that simple. If you can remember what to say. Okay. This is what our pralines look like. We'll show you them when they're ready to eat. They look nummy. Nom 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 Okay, so <laughs> since she's not going to say anything. Well. <laughs> I guess we are going to uh, taste, taste it. Yes, taste. Hi. Oh, so crunchy. Mmm. 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 Perfect flavor. Seriously, perfect flavor. Mm -hmm. Hardens nicely. Keep your hands out. It what? It set fine. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> anyway, recipe will be down below. Don't forget gamers and geeks can cook playlists. And check out Nerdy Cooking Lady. Yep. And we will see you guys next time. Don't move. I'm taking a nap. Bite me. Ah! <laughs> Night, y'all.